everyone, I'm Kelly D and Valentine's Day is just around the corner. So if you haven't bought those flowers, wine, I have the perfect gift for you. It's quick, easy and healthy. Today we're going to be making chocolate covered strawberries. Though this is a Valentine's Day treat, you don't have to do it on Valentine's Day only. You can use it for any special occasion, Mother's Day, birthdays, anniversaries. So let's go over the ingredients. We have strawberries, beautiful strawberries. We have some dark chocolate. We have white chocolate. We have some sprinkles for decorating. And though this isn't an ingredient, you will we'll need some kebab sticks. First step is to prepare the strawberries. Now once you bought your strawberries from the supermarket, be sure to wash them and pat them dry. It is extremely important that your strawberries be dry because once they are wet any type of moisture the chocolate will not stick to the strawberries so wash them and pat them dry and then you will see there are some strawberries that are really large like this one just for consistency we're gonna chop them in half to make sure that they're nice and even so once we have our strawberries they're nice and even they're dry we're gonna set them aside then we'll prepare our chocolate Let's prepare our chocolate now when choosing your chocolate it's important to choose the right type of chocolate so it can melt easily make sure when you go to the supermarket your chocolate has cocoa butter in it now to melt it we're gonna cut it into some small sections it makes it easier to cut and once we've cut it we're gonna do the double boiler method. Now there are two ways that you can melt your chocolate. You can put it into a microwave for about 30 seconds and take it out, stir it around, and once it isn't completely melted, put it in again for another 10 seconds, take it back out, then five seconds all the way until it is completely melted. But my favorite way is to use a double the double boiler method. We're gonna put some water on the stove, and once we have that water on, we're gonna put a glass bowl over the water, over the saucepan. We're gonna make sure it does not fit into the saucepan, so it has to be larger than the saucepan. And then we're ready. We'll do the same for the white chocolate. Now our water is boiling, so we're gonna get ready to melt the chocolate. We're gonna use a process called tempering. And tempering chocolate simply means we're gonna heat it we're going to cool it then we're going to heat it again so we're not going to use all of the chocolate we're going to use just like uh two thirds and we're going to keep back one third so we're going to add the chocolate over the saucepan in the glass bowl remember this is the double boiler method and we'll allow the chocolate to melt and we're going to keep back just a third of it this is the tempering method so when this starts to melt we must make sure it goes to like 113 degrees then we're going to take it off we're going to add the remaining chocolate and that will help to cool it down to about 80 degrees then we're going to heat it up again for about five seconds now if you have a thermometer at home just make sure the temperature is just between 110 to 113 or if you don't have one at home make sure it's almost melted now it's time to take it off Add the remaining chocolate and this should cool down the temperature of the existing of the chocolate here oh it's gonna be hot so please be careful and we'll continue to melt it we'll check the temps again but if you don't have a thermometer all you need to do is to make sure that is completely melted this process is called tempering once I'm done here, I'm going to do the same thing with the white chocolate. Then we'll get ready to dip these strawberries into this amazing chocolate for the perfect Valentine gift. While our white chocolate is melting, we're going to go ahead and prepare our strawberries for dipping. So we're going to take the skewer and we're going to insert it into the strawberry. You're not going to go all the way through. And we're going to put it in the glass to make it easy. Then we're going to get ready to dip.
I'll refrigerate them for about 10 minutes. Our chocolate covered strawberries are done and they look amazing. Now be sure to just be creative and do whatever you want. I had white chocolate but I didn't add the white chocolate yet. I'm going to spend some time just decorating with the white chocolate. You can use chocolate chip cookies and just crumble to the top. You can use chopped nuts. You can do whatever you want to just express yourself. Now it's time to taste. So decadent. Nice crust on the nice chocolate on the outside, soft strawberry on the inside. Chocolate covered strawberries. Now you need to try it. If you enjoyed this Valentine treat, you just need to look over here, see my other video with other Valentine treats, and once you've watched it, just click the button below, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. So you're notified every time I post a video. And remember to leave me a comment. I love hearing from you. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone.